Why bother, pal? Why bother? Um, so you, you kind of stay on the right, on the right track, uh, but giving you the, the illusion of variety. <laughs> oh, shoot. Hey! That was 69! Holy shit! That a boy, doggy. Hey everybody and welcome to the next installment of our Final Fantasy VI walkthrough. Uh, we've been playing this now for several hours. I think we're up to about seven or eight hours. Um, uh, before I go further though, uh, hit that subscribe button if you like this game and want to see more of the playthrough. I will be playing it all the way through and like I said, I'm about six to seven hours in. I, I think there's like 20 or 30 hours total in this. Um, there's still a lot of major plot points coming up. I can't wait to, to, to get to them. Um, so yeah, hit the subscribe, like the video if, if you're enjoying it. Uh, and uh, you know, and just kind of uh, hang out and, and let's, let's kind of enjoy these games together um, as we kind of push through um, Final Fantasy VI and other titles. Now in this installment, this is actually a lot going on in this installment um, because we meet three, or pardon me, two new characters. We visit a, new, a castle, we visit um, a plains, and then there's a ghost train as well. So um, let me kind of walk you through what you're gonna see. Now Saban has just walked, washed ashore on a foreign land that, that as, a, as a player, I, I had not seen until this moment in the game. So you're kind of exploring this, this um, unknown territory. And fortunately, you wash up right next to a hut, a little house. Um, you go in there and that's where you see that ninja that you had seen in, the, in a town previously. He's now hanging out at this hut. He joins your party immediately, and that's um, so that kind of uh, gives Saban, our you know the main character of this party, a chance to just kind of. He's, so you're not going through it alone, of course. So as you're walking through, you're kind of exploring the plains, um, and when you walk into uh, Imperial Fort, and that's where you, you see Kafka again, and you're going to see some character development that I think is is really interesting that um, you know, puts him in a new light um, as far as his dynamic between him and the new, new character. Another new character, that he's not playable, is General Leo, who's one of, one of the Imperial's um, you know, generals, General Leo. <laughs> um, and so you're gonna see him, uh, see that dynamic there of that relationship, and then we're gonna uh, see this samurai, another new character uh, from the, a castle called Doma, and his tragic story, how it un unfolds, and I'm, I know I'm being serious and all that, but I think this is really great storytelling, and I, I am having fun. This, this is a fun thing to kind of get to know these characters and learn about kind of what their motivations are. Um, so this guy, you get his motivation right away, and you'll see when he, you see what happens to his castle, you'll understand. Now, after we get out of that predicament, that situation, Kafka goes on his merry way, and we start walking and we run into this phantom train, which is a major, it's a really big moment in the game. Um, and, uh, you know, we, we get some um, otherworldly uh, partners in some of the battles. And it really, uh, you know, again, shows another level of storytelling um, that starts putting the supernatural into the discussion. And so it's, it's really, uh, it's, it's cool. It's cool. It's cool. It's, it's cool to see... Um, you know that thrown into there and thrown into there i will say smoothly right and it doesn't disrupt anything and that's kind of hard to do when you just talk start talking about supernatural things um so after that you know when, when you when we make it through that there's a, there's a really big moment in the game as well in that in the like the, the end of that scene um and you can see the chapters in the in the video below if you want to jump from scene to scene um and the next part would be this place called the belt which is essentially a plains area. And that's where you see a wildling type character if you've seen Game of Thrones. And I named him Gollum. So I'll give you a little example of kind of what this guy, this guy is. Uh, he ends up being really a, a, a big part of this party because he can mimic so many different attacks from different enemies. And if you pick the right one, 
Oh, you'll see in an upcoming battle that that is a big deal. So we we're gonna so again recapping, we're gonna see Saban finding the ninja, finding the samurai. Big thing happens at the castle. You see Kafka again, go to a phantom train, and um, you'll see a big moment there as well. Uh, find another character that I named Gollum um, in the plains, and uh, and kind of establish that a little bit um, before we move forward uh with with this um uh story and we go swimming as well uh so a lot going on in this in this episode if you want to call it that of this installment uh and i hope you enjoy it and check it out and subscribe uh, but yeah remember though the chapter at the bottom if you want to just jump ahead to different different points in the in the story um, I'm, I'm trying to chop them up in a, in, a, in a good way where at least the major plot points you can kind of go through one by one if you want to check them out. And um, so enjoy enjoy this. And I, I don't do a lot of commentary today. I, th I think uh, or I, I should say I, I'm not doing a lot of commentary after the fact. Like the commentary for me gaming is in there, um, but there wasn't a lot of editing in this. I think there's a, there's a lot of moments here that are important to keep. So it's a little bit of a longer video, um, but that's why the chapters hopefully will help you um, at least get some enjoyment out of it and really uh you know drive home the the highlights of this next hour and a half long video don't mind the hair because i don't uh we'll talk to you again sometime soon we'll probably play this for an hour or hour or two maybe um trying to get some more deeper into this whole thing. Ooh. Ninja Man. Oh, no, 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 no. <whistles> Narsh. I got separated from my friends. <clears throat> the Empire set up camp just beyond the forest of the east. You're coming with me, right, homie? What are they doing here? to have their eyes on Doma. Your only road passes through Doma. I can take you there if you like. Perfect. And I think that's where the samurai is from, right? Absolutely. Death is always just a step behind me. Oh, that's nice and encouraging. Yeah, that's better. Right, we'll go around the edge here. Mm -mm. There we go, that works. So, um, just, yeah, what I was saying is that, that that little shop in the middle of nowhere, um, it's so cool because it's, it's funneling you into a certain story. Arr! Why bother, pal? Why bother? Um, so you, you kind of stay on, this right, on the right track, uh, but giving you the, the illusion of... Variety? Well, shoot. Hey! That was 69! Holy shit! That a boy, doggy. What's over here? I thought there was something over here. But it does not look like it. The three parties. Because we were sent down the river. And that is kind of where we are now. One of the parties already made it to their destination. And now this party is safe and he got washed away. Uh, we jumped into the river after a villain. So now we're kind of seeing where this story takes us. And those of you who don't know, I, I played this game before a long time ago. Um, and it's been fun to kind of reconnect with it because I mean it is a great game I, I think it's a great game it's a great probably the best game I've ever played um, still to this day and I've played a lot of games um, shit what is that poison question is does that stay with him no okay good mm -mm -mm. I like how the map tells you exactly where to go <laughs> Going up here? Or? Oh, there's a bridge. Okay. 
Here we go. Here we go. I remember now. <clears throat> the Imperial camp. There are an awful lot of soldiers here. This is awesome. So this is the, this kind of starts the um, super close interaction between like our parties and the um, the Empire, right? Hey, did you hear? They say Kafka's planning to drive away General Leo so he can take over his position as General. General Leo, I remember him now too. Um, I gotta say something about this music, and I think I think Final Fantasy has always had like great music and. Um, I don't know the name of the composer, but I know he gets some really good props. Um, but it's always perfect for the mood, you know. I mean, if it's, if it's and this game, honestly, it was one of the first to like keep to do a bunch of different moods, you know. Um, so it was good that they had a really good composer to kind of make sure everything fits with the thing. Oh, here he is. <laughs> <laughs> Kiss ass. <coughs> um, but yeah, yeah, it's so the music is like this right now. It's like in movies, right? And like in movies, you have like certain themes for certain people. Like everyone knows the Empire theme from Star Wars, and then the theme from, uh, you know, and then when the heroes come around, it's a different jukebox if you will that's kind of same with this how many times are you gonna make me say it Storm the castle. Have fun storming the castle. <clears throat> Ooh. This is awesome. This is so cool. Again, like the, the the I don't know the drama, right? They really play up the drama in this game. That's that's. Here we go. Who's the savior? Yeah, hey, there he, there he is. He looks different. I used to read like the Dungeons and Dragons books, um, and I used to always like name some of my characters after. Them. So I'm going to name this guy, actually. Sturm, because I believe he was one of the guys in the Dungeons and Dragons books. Um, so, I'll, I'll name him. I think that's right. If we can but fight the commander, they should break rank and withdraw. Mm -hmm. Was he a samurai or was he just a warrior? I forgot. Um, but yeah, so this is the, uh... Do we get a one-on-one? -on -one? Defeat the commander. <laughs> Alright, so I'm controlling him now. Let's go, bitch. Retainer to the kingdom, Doma. Ready that axe, bitch. Bam, bam. Ooh, son of a... Ooh, what's Bushido? <clears throat> Dodge! Duck and cover, baby. Ooh. I don't know what that means. <laughs> I have no idea what I just did. 
Whoa! Wow! Bah. Retreat! Retreat! Ah, <laughs> look at you have the big eyeballs. Right here. <laughs> bah, uh, mm. I'm gonna wait them out in the castle. Why am I a ninja now? Okay, so what am I supposed to do? Sneak by or did I kill him? knows how to meow like a cat. This dog is terrible. What are you supposed to, supposed to be, huh? Shit, shit, shit! appear to be playing a waiting game. Damn, look at the guy. I will crush you. So they're using their favorite strategy. Looks like the dude from Karate, or Karate Kid, Rocky. Uh, ready to storm the castle as soon as you give the order. Now there will be too many unnecessary casualties. Yeah, see, this is where you start to see. So, let me tell you what this does. And this is, this is the cool thing about it. You know, and I think this is just good storytelling. It's not anything unique to Final Fantasy, but it kind of was to Final Fantasy, or probably to this game at the time. Um, the good, the good villains, right? Like this guy actually has seems to have like some sort of consideration for humanity, which is great, and that makes you different, feel different about like killing him, fighting him. Um, now why is he gonna tell him to calm down? You're from Miranda, are you not? I mean, yes, sure I am. Well, why do you ask? You would have me go there and deliver the news of your passage to your family? What would I say when I had it from the your sword? How could I even look at them? You're a human being before you're a soldier. Don't be so eager to throw away your life. See, that, I, I, you know, this is going to be a broken record for every single um, installment or, or every time I game or play place part of this it's I'll be a broken record because it's just it's just this this is wasn't what role-playing games were then I, I say that hesitantly there were some good games but this really took it to this different level where like this guy's a bad guy bad guy um, in the game but um, you know you start to kind of feel like he's a human being too and that's that's it's just good storytelling, right? It's not, again, it's not unique to this thing, but like, it was cool in the video game when I was what? I think I looked it up and it came out in 97, so I guess I was 20 years old. Um, still playing video games and trying to learn how to how these games were. I mean, so, Gestalt wouldn't want you to die for nothing. That's where I disagree. Gestalt doesn't give a shit. Kafka does not, for sure. Ba -ba -ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Carrier pigeon from Gestal. What? The Emperor summons me. I must return at once. Understood, sir. I'll leave the rest in your hands. Alright, y'all are going down. Don't rush them, that's all I ask. Leave it to us, sir. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Seems like a decent dude. <laughs> Here we go. 
Oh my god! Yes! Yes! Oh, I cannot get over this. This is a great story. It's insane. It's insane how great this is. I remember this now. I remember this. I don't want to ruin it for anyone who hasn't played it yet. But holy shit, I get it now. I remember now. I remember. The Emperor is coming back home. Try not to cause any trouble in my absence. I'll take care of this faster than you ever would. Easy, Kafka. Nothing dirty, Kafka. Still human beings. Try not to forget that. Oh, good thing he didn't turn us right. <laughs> And going back to the music, I mean, the music fits this whole tone of the discussion, you know? Oof, it's the poison ready. Some of our people are prisoner inside. If any of them predict the water, who cares? They're the ones stupid enough to get caught by the enemy. See, again, cold, heartless, and... Oof, what a bastard. Oh shit. Ouch. <laughs> <Do they wait? laughs> no, you don't, you motherfucker. Just a wuss. God, how long do you expect me to put with this? Next time I won't hold back. Yeah, right. Me throw a glove. Oh shit! boys let's heal up too after this because I don't want to fight Kefka shorthanded shit shit whoa Son of a bitch. Pum, 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 pum. No! Alright, so we got him. We got we got him good. Alright, come on, Kafka. Handle the rest. Oh, hello. Come back. Yeah, here you go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna master that one. Nice, guys. Nice. Well, fucking fought, baby. Hell yeah. Ba -ba -na. Exposition, baby. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh no, here's he's poisoning it. Mm -mm 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 -mm. 
So you start seeing this and Sir Sturm Yes, it does. Don't drink it. Um, yeah. Here we go. I knew it. Do it. Just dropping dead. This is so cool. I mean, this is just like the storytelling that you just love to see in movies. And here I was, again, 20 years old, never seen this kind of thing in a game. And then all this stuff happened, and you're thinking, like, wow. Sprint shoes? Is this the way the king is? I have no idea. Yeah, here we go. To the king, with all haste. I wish I can't get a fucking. Sprint shoes. Whoa. Mm. Sturm, your excellency. service. Failed to protect our kingdom. Excellency, the fault lies now with thee. I fear for your family. My chest burns with every breath. There may still be survivors in the castle. Let's split up and search. Give me, where are your sprint shoes? Sad music, right? Hmm. Hmm. His baby, his kid. What? So this is one of the more direct, like you actually experience the exposition, so to speak. You know what I mean? Like before, we were talking about how this game does a really good job like when when you're in between battles and, and events to like have the characters talk to each other to learn more about their lives and here you're really learning it like as it's happening you kind of see what his motivation is when he does end up joining the returners um and it's pretty pretty dope Boom, there he is. Fuck the Empire. <clears throat> Let me give you a hand. Let's do it. <laughs> oh, you're dead. Do a takedown. 
Kafka, homie. Mm. Woo! Big boys. <clears throat> oh, hello. Hello, Fang. <clears throat> How's our hit points? Hit points are fine. Okay, good. I am in thy debt. No need for thanks. I'm saving from the kingdom of Figaro. Let's get out of here. But I must avenge my family and my countrymen. If we stick around any longer, we'll have an entire regiment down our throats. There they are. This way. <laughs> oh boy. I have an idea. Follow me. Book a bear fairy. Follow me. What manner of armored beast might these be? I'll explain later. Just climb in. <laughs> no, I'm gonna start and talk with you. All right, push it down. <laughs> some levity, some levity. Boys, wow, that was quick. Hey, there, here they come. Stop them. Oh, guys, you guys, you guys have no, no, no chance against this. So it's funny because this is like just, remember, this is just one third of the story as it's all playing out together, you know? Um, and this, and all this intrigue and whatever happened on this. Oh, here we go. Yeah, we're about to. Um, happened just in this one area. What? <laughs> that wasn't what I meant. That was a good one. Mm -hmm. We should be saved now. So how do we get to Nars from here? The only route passes through the forest of the... Ooh! Ooh! Ha ha! The South Forest. Yeah, this is this is gonna be a good a good uh let's let's do a tent, actually. Adios, bitch. Oh let's do a tent and kinda of rest up a little bit. Oh, it's our only tent, it's just that are you sure? Damn it. I guess it's not just start the top of his tent. <laughs> the save as well. Mm -hmm. I feel like there's some really cool stuff about to happen. Oh shit, this is where you, I'm gonna get lost. This is a maze, isn't it? Spring, okay, that's good. I guess I didn't even use my damn tent. <clears throat> Ooh. This is gonna be, okay. My first real challenge, I think. Because this is like, do you go up, down, 
around or what? See, I think I'm right back at the beginning, aren't I? At least one of them attacked, that's good. Oof. Damn. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, I made it. Okay, now this is gonna be awesome. This is a big moment in the game, and I love it. And I love it. I think a train I thought that all of the Doma's railways have been destroyed in the fighting let's take a look inside hmm sir Saban <laughs> just run around and find out what happens to inside Look at he look at him, he's so debonair. This is a big moment in the game. What in the world? <clears throat> Must live at once. This is the Phantom Train. There you go. <laughs> look at the ninja surprise face. <laughs> Oops, I'm about to go straight down to get out of there. What's this? Alright, well that's not it's impossible. The door won't open. Oh, this music. Here we go, baby. Another soundtrack. It carries the souls of the heart to their final destination. Ha! <laughs> Make for the engine. Timetables, they're all blank. Mm -mm. What business brings you here? Tell us about the train. The Phantom Train ferries the souls of the part of the other side. We know that. Once they arrive, they're granted the eternal rest. Okay. How do we stop it? You want to stop the train? Search every corner of the engineer's department. I'm sure there's a way. You liar. I wonder what this is for. Why don't we see what happens when we pull it? <laughs> in the game baby I love this I'm loving it wait what's that oh, it's nothing. well what's with this guy he seems to want to accompany us sure well <laughs> uh oh do I get to attack with him yeah cool Dancing ghost, baby. Dancing ghost. Oh, come on.
Oh shit. Wasted steps when you're trying to get as good as. Oh, are we supposed to avoid them? Nice. <laughs> there we go. Oh no, I thought he would, would be joining us. Uh, that's e easy. Nice. Um, yeah, so 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 I'm a reporter. I'm a writer, right? So for a long time, I've had a big kind of interest in writing. Uh, I want to see which ones will stay with me. Um, and so, like, that's why I love this game so much. Um, there's a lot of really good writing. Ah, a lot of really good writing in it. Um, and even from like what event to event you kind of see the in between like right now remember this is just again one third of us just leaving that um the returners hideout right this is one of the stories that happened to be one of them we're on the second one i've got a top poly item see i knew there were some people who are not we have six let's, let's get 300 or 300 guilds worth Green cherry, what does this do? Curious the imp, okay. Bum, bum, bum. One person, huh? Don't really need that then. Sure you can. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Okay. And you wanna sell? Eh. Wait, why doesn't he have the why doesn't he have the black belt? I might as well get him the black belt, right? Black bot, blah, 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 blah. where it was sometimes counter physical attacks. Perfect. In fact, we just try to get a couple of those. <laughs> this is the guy that's supposed to stop me? Come on, I can do this in three seconds, boy. What do you suppose that was all about? No escape. Here we go. This is the crazy. Huh? No escape. Who's there? Uh oh. Rot row. They're coming after us. Go up the stairs, bruh. Nowhere to run, nowhere to hide, no escape for you. Up. Bum, bum. They just don't let up. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Woo, here we go. Well, there's gotta be something back here, right? Ah, shoot. These guys are really powerful. If you let them get worked up. Stop it. Oh, here we go again. <laughs> bye bye. through this? Ooh. Oh, 
That's good. Nice. There we go. Let's take him out and then save. That was on purpose. We're still number X there. We're still number X. Here we go, baby. Let's, let's finish this up and then we'll call it a, a session. I think, right? Yeah, it's been about 45 minutes, I think. We'll go ahead and call it a session for now. We'll probably come back later tonight, though. Mm. Anyone hurting particularly bad? High potion get all of us, right? Yeah. Come on with us, baby. I don't mind maximizing my experience points when I can, you know? And I don't think any of these people are super, super complicated. Oh. Something interesting is about to happen. Please be seated if you wish to order. Can't eat this. Hold the right, oh shit. Who are you? Siegfried, the greatest swordsman in the world. The treasure belongs to me. Alright, finish them off, let's go. Ba, ba, ba. Yeah, I have no problem battling, I have no problem, you know, because they're, they're all, I mean, my guys are really strong, because I did a, a couple hours of just leveling up when I was in Chicago, so. Mm -mm -mm. Now I'm not sure if anybody's... That's good. I'm not sure if you guys have seen my previous streams on this, but you know, playing this game is like one of the coolest things right now. I mean, I think I haven't played in a very long time. Um, and all right, come with us. 
And so everything I do is like a new rediscovered oh, connector. You know, rediscovered thing. Oh shit, like even Siegfried, like I, I forgot about him, so I just bought him. Um, and that's, that's awesome, it's like you're playing it for the first time again. Uh, this is like, I love that it's on Steam and I have like all the other games now on Steam. You want to stop the train? Search every corner of the engineer's compartment. I'm sure there's a way. We're still gonna have, have points, yeah. We're, we're good, okay. Mm -mm -mm. Sure, Wally's gonna be a fight, and that's fine. Ooh, sniper eye. <laughs> Ooh, that's a good one. Nicely done. I go with my scriptures anymore. Oh shit. That's a terrible battle or, or attack. God damn it. Nice, nice rebound. Or, uh, I gotta remember how this works. We gotta find a way to stop this fast, okay? So we're gonna stop the train, shut the first and third pressure valves, then throw the switch located by the smokestack. We're gonna fight the train. Yeah, that's right. That's right. That's right. So you're the ones who have been slowing me down. Bring it, bitch. Here we go. This is a tough one, if I recall. No, that wasn't what I wanted. Damn it. Nice shot. Shoot again. Oh my god, shit, we lost him. Yeah. Oh no, he doesn't get his I don't think he gets experience points there. I will let you go, but first there's something I must do. anybody watches this <laughs> it seems we have arrived it's nice dialogue <laughs> glad to be off that thing the 
faster we leave that train behind, the better. Agreed. Here it is. Oof. <clears throat> Is that Elaine? Owen? Gut punch, baby. So happy, thank you. I'll keep practicing with my swords and keep mom safe. It's a sad time, right? I mean, this is great. This is a great storytelling. Oh, so cool. And with that, I believe that's gonna do it for this session. I think we're gonna go back to the place where all three of the parties split up after this. Let's leave him be. Oh shit, he's dead. Nice. <laughs> hey, what's up, buddy? <laughs> yeah, I'm playing this game. I've always played this, played the game so many times that I just don't. Uh, I can't love it enough. DC Gator. I feel like you sound familiar. The name does. So let's um, pick this guy up a little bit. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I'm playing this uh, all the way through, and then I said earlier I downloaded like a bunch of other Final Fantasy games. I'll be, uh, I should probably save it, right? Yeah, let's save it. So yeah, I'm playing this game. I'm trying to finish it through all the way, and then at some point, um, I mean, I just love the game. I love everything about this game. All the, uh, oh shit, that's right. I remember now. This must be Baron Falls. Um, yeah, I remember this. So it's been cool to watch this game, like just kind of uh, as I'm playing, and it's it's, it's been um, fun to just relearn the story. To the south of here lies the belt. Ooh, I remember that. That's where we get that, that fucking uh, animal guy. Tis a wild and dangerous land inhabited by all manner of ferocious beasts. If we turn around, the empire will be waiting for us. Uh, the village of Moblitz. Moblitz, okay. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay, so I think I'm going to call this actually a session. Oh man, see a ninja. Thanks for your help. Let's team up again sometime. Oh, we will. We will. Jump in. Let's go, baby. I think that's gonna get us. Oh shit, I forgot. We, we are not playing. Holy crap. Holy crap. I, I thought this was it. I realized we were fighting our way down. Um, yeah, I, again, like I said, I haven't played so long time. And the funny thing is, like, so when we're playing this game way back in the day, you don't expect this because you never see something like this where, you know, these weird 
weird settings where you fight. But yeah, this is a good one. Uh, it always surprised you. That's what was awesome about this game when you were a 20-year-old punk kid just playing. Why not even chain? I don't care. Good thing is I leveled up. Like there was a while there that I just did leveling up for a couple hours. Uh, because I was in Chicago, I didn't want to play forward. Um, because I wasn't streaming. Here we go. This is the end guy. It's gotta be. He's a different color. <laughs> oh, here we go with the blizzard shit. God damn. Bad though, I got my tip point in a good spot. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, boy. Yeah, every time, every little twist and turn on this game, is, it was, was like such a cool thing when you're, when you're just starting to play for the first time. Um, and so even now, like, because I've forgotten everything, it's it's like pretty, uh, pretty cool to kind of see. I believe this is going to be the end of this, this, what, fork in this road, right? Mm, hey, this guy, what do I name him? I'm going to name him Gollum. <laughs> Youth draped in monster hides, his eyes shining with a warm and gentle light. Sounds like Gollum to me. some weird way to get him, don't they? Yeah, man, my guys are powerful right now. That's good. I mean, it'll catch, I mean, the whole thing will catch up to me, I'm sure. Hey, buddy. Wow. You defend him? Shit, I don't have what I need, do I? Green cherry? I don't know. <laughs> what do I give him? I feel like I, I haven't gotten to the place where I need to go to get it. Sorry, pal. I don't have it. I don't have anything you need. Hmm, what's that? One to three. That's weird. Oh, I see. Duh. Elixir, ether. Echo screen, eye drops, teleport stone. Green cherry's the only thing I can think of. That's the only food I have. Run. Alright, I need to find that town. In that town, you get some things to you can feed him, if I remember right. And I may not be remembering right at all. All right, let's see who can sell me something. You came down Baron Falls? Unbelievable, it's flowing even stronger than usual this year. No one's been able to get here lately. Carrier pigeons are, are only linked to the outside world. Somebody give me some greens or something like that, right? That's a chocobo, I guess. I got another saying that I had. Damn right. So you guys gonna be Helping or hurting, huh? Keep that in mind.
No, I need, um, I want to attract Gollum. <laughs> I don't think Gollum's an optional character, is he? He might be. All right, give me some greens or something. What, what do we have? Dried meat. Uh, is that it? Yeah, that's gotta be it, right? Let's go find this kid again. Oops, not the Fendi. <laughs> gonna show up is it now that I have this the thing I need. You know it's funny like I was I was playing the game and I and um you know you, when you're like me and you really don't do a lot of twitching or twitch streaming you don't do a lot of talking on twitch you don't really know how to do it really so I kind of lost track of the fact that I'm on Twitch, and I think there's somebody came on here, and like, and I was quiet for a while. So he said, um, "You have a viewer," uh, which I think is like basically my bad. You kind of, I kind of forget, you kind of forget to uh, that that's part of it, and, and so yeah, literally my bad. I wasn't even, I'm not even like saying that in any sort of uh, <laughs> smart ass way. Um, yeah, so let's let's see, let's see if we can get, get this this guy again. In the meantime, we'll just grow our experience, right? The good news is we're all we're pretty yeah they're barely hitting us and we kill them for one attack, so that's good. Here we go. Wow! Give him some meat. How do I... How do I give it to him? How do I give him the, the meat? Because I think that's what I need to do, right? It just happened. I don't know how to give him the meat, if this is the right way to do it or not. Um, There it is. Hey, is all it takes to do it multiple times. What the? <laughs> what a peculiar child. I am Sturm, and this is Sabin. You, Sabin. You stern. Me want more food. It's not all gone. Save it. Give it to him.
And they're frolicking around in the in the veldt. This goes back to like the music variety, right? We're in the, the Velt, some sort of prairie land or something, or, or distant land, right? So the, the music changes and that's pretty awesome. You angry? <laughs> I think it's perfect that I called him Gollum with the shiny thing. <laughs> shiny, shiny, shiny. Can anything be that shiny? Uh, 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 uh. Mr. Thou like shiny thing. You talking to me or you talking to to Saban? <laughs> Mr. Thou's that one over there. <laughs> Gollum's Treasure. Wow, that was a perfect name for this guy. Is it? I think it's a pretty big deal, isn't it? Like a big like relic or some shit. That Moblis. Sturm stand place forever bring you. Crescent moon. Shiny thing there. Okay. So we'll be off. Oh, let's see what's at this crescent mountain of us. I'm gonna go to the town too. Uh, I'm going to town briefly to get some food for this weirdo. <laughs> Little moonwalker. Here's the... Uh, Tutorial. Here's how to build up Gollum's skills. Choose Leap, a command that appears only when you're on the belt. Keep fighting on the belt and eventually Gollum will reappear. When he reappears real, when the attacks of the monsters you were fighting when you left, as well as those you were fighting when you returned. Cool? Please continue your quest. Dope. So I am gonna call that. See, here's the thing. I want to explore this town first. And I thought I thought we were gonna go to uh, to this new or back to another storyline here, but I guess not for a while. Um, so let me just buy weapons and armor, and then I'm going to call it a knight. Um, Kotetsu, let's get him all geared up. 
Mithril Claws. Okay, that's good too. Mm -hmm. Let's equip this shit before I... Um, relics. Lock in the target for the physical attack. Never miss. Let's do a, a more physical guy. Sure, whatever. Get him whatever he can, I guess. Alright. So let's explore this town a little bit. And then to call it. So let's get a buckler. Could use a few of those. Actually, start the bottom. Have iron, iron armor. We'll get two of those. Wait, do we have? We do have that uh, warrior at the bottom. I didn't know that. I guess I forgot. Let's get him Kempa G. Iron Helmet's got a few of those. Where am I? Okay, I still have a lot, lot, of, lot of fucking money left. Alright. Mega Hat. <laughs> okay, that's good. Let's stay at the end. Let's see what's up here. Stay at the end. Easy. And then we'll go and uh, <coughs> there. let me know if you need anything. I can send letters and packages to any corner of the world for you. Hmm. That might be useful. In fact, I think it is. The entrance of the serpent tent lies between Crescent Mountain near the southern tip of the continent. Okay, that's good to know. And I think that's where we need to go next. Um, but that will be next time because it's about that time to have some dinner. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see. Powerful logic currents run through the serpent trench. No. Here we go. Was that Crescent Island? That's gotta be Crescent Island. Mm, well, this goes back to Narsh, maybe. There's Doma, I believe. That was always one of the cool things too when you start learning the map and realizing like what's what. Um, that's actually a big part of like just building and being uh, just learning at last. Hop into the current and you'd be swept straight to Nikia. Too bad our only diving home was stolen. Okay. That sounds like a quest. <laughs> mm -mm 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 -mm. You have to be quiet. Soldier in here, huh? I'm a soldier from Miranda. When I talked for the Empire, I was forced to join the Imperial Army. Trying to flee, they came after me. I barely escaped alive. Sure. There's even more Imperial soldiers walking the streets of Miranda these days, but things are peaceful otherwise. The flowers in the garden will soon bloom and announce the arrival of spring. How are you doing? I'm worried. I so wish that I could fly to your side and be with you. Please think only about getting better and try not to push yourself too hard. Rest knowing it's been every day thinking of you. Oh, sweet. Now what do I do with the letter? I'd like to write it back, but I don't even have the strength to pick up a pen. I'll write for you later. Um... Yeah, let's go. I dress is really but condition needs to be improved. Let's 
That? Oh, relics, okay. Uh, we have two already. Might as well, right? 5,000 bucks, we have a bunch of cash on hand. <laughs> Still your bed. Let's go out of the town, save it, and we call this a day, boys and girls. Duane and Catarina. Everyone's running around. So you can't see him though, can you? So there you have it. Everybody, another installment of Final Fantasy VI. And I will remind you to please subscribe and check out my other videos on this channel. If you love Final Fantasy VI, we'll be playing this all the way through. So hope you enjoyed it and look forward to the next one.